lie for the same reason women lie, which is they are afraid. People are afraid of the outcome of whatever the truth is. Sometimes people fear the truth itself as if the truth will attack them, <laughs> destroy them, but the truth will always set you free. Hey, welcome to Spirit Soul Science Information for Your Soul. I am Sharice and I have been spending a lot of time on the internet recently. I am in transition in my life and I have a lot of time and I'm just consuming a lot of information, trying to make sense of the world. One of the things I came across was this um, idea that men lie and I've been lied to by people. I mean, men and women and children, people, people lie. It's, it's one of the functions of humanity. We are endlessly trying to figure out how to be happy and healthy in this world. And that means resisting the urge of lying. So the core at the core of telling lies is fear. Fear of not getting what you want, fear of getting what you want, fear that you will be punished, just fear. People are afraid. And it makes sense that people would be afraid. But I was also reading about where, where we're taught lies, where uh, we're rewarded for lies, because, I mean, so the way I live my life, I'm, I'm very authentic. I am by no means perfect. I have not reached enlightenment. But honesty is one of the things that I practice, like, mm like a lot, like I just, I'm just such a really honest person. And so in the past, I used to be a blunt, honest person, but I've learned, well, I've learned that people don't like honesty, but I've learned that the best way to serve honesty is in a kind and compassionate manner. And just because you're being honest doesn't mean what you have to say needs to be said. Like I've learned, I don't have to say everything. Like. Sometimes the kind thing to do is to not say anything. I'm not lying, but the kind thing to do is not say anything, uh, which makes me think of lies by omission. Lies by omission are still lies. <laughs> it's still a way to manipulate another person, um, get what you want because you think, believe, know that if you tell the truth, you are not going to get what you want. I, I think it's very difficult being honest in 2020, in this millennia, um, people want to be lied to. One of my concerns on this platform, YouTube, and being a content creator is trying to figure out, you know, how best to communicate my honesty with folks. Because people, not most people, but people, you probably appreciate honesty. If you're watching my video, you likely appreciate honesty. But if you look, at Instagram, I have a whole other video titled, I hate Instagram. If you look at Instagram, I think because of the nature of visuals, it's very, very easy to, for it just to be a lie, for it to be a sham. But we flock to Instagram and we flock for the validation, even though we know it's lies. <laughs> that you won't be able to tell really the difference between a lie and who's being authentic. Why do we do that? I don't, I don't have the answer to that. I know why we lie. I know why I lie. I rarely lie, but I know why I do it. To, to keep the peace, to not stress anyone out. But a man lied to me recently and I am just, I'm such an understanding person that I am always a little bit stunned when people close to me lie to me. <laughs> uh, but the reason for his lying I, I was clear. There was a lot of ego involved. And when people have ego and con are controlled by their ego, they just usually just don't make good decisions. And I'm, when I say ego, I don't mean like um, someone who's arrogant or bossy or, or anything like that. Synonyms for the ego in the context that I'm using it in is the devil, your shadow side, fear, all of those things can control the way you interact with other people and whether you lie. And I want you to know, lying is a betrayal to yourself first. What do you think happens to your soul when you tell lies, when you are not your authentic self to people? You are attacking yourself first. You're betraying your own self. And so really there's no person who wins when you tell a lie. And I would encourage you to find a way to be honest in your life, honest in work, honest in your relationships, to be your whole authentic self. Show up as you are so that your soul can be happy. Because Thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe and share this video with someone you think it may help.